When I was young, I was diagnosed with a disease called cerebral palsy. Growing up, I was always a positive thinking kid. I'm never negative about myself because God created me this way and I'm proud of it. I was influenced by God at a young age. My grandma used to always take me to church every Sunday, teach me about God's word. And I, w I was already open to reading the Bible. And that's why until today, I still carry that attitude that never give up on life because God will never give up on you. With the condition that I have, there were challenges along the way and I've, and I've been discriminated by some people saying that I'm a handicap and I have no, nowhere to go and I just proved them wrong. I've been through heartbreak in high school and everybody, like, I've often got rejected but, but um, I just learned that you can't always please everybody. How do you, how do you remain positive about yourself? My secret is just let life flow and just, just be you. Don't be afraid of anything. Don't be ashamed of what God has given you and your talents and everything. My faith in God helps me to become better, bolder, stronger. God loves us and I will always carry that with me. Everything in life is a test. God is testing me. He's telling me right now to inspire others, encourage them, and open their minds and hearts to Him. When I came to Charisma, seeing other Christians made me feel better about myself. And I encouraged them like they encouraged me. If you are here today and if you are struggling with your life, with whatever condition you have, just remember that there is someone up there watching you and he will never leave your side. Whatever happens, heartbreak, whatever, life's negativities, just remember that someone up there is watching you and he is our real father and that is our heavenly father, God Almighty Jesus Christ. I worship God because I know it is the right way to live life and, and that's what life is all about. Life is not focused on us, our wants and needs, it's, it's mainly focused on God and nothing but God.